One of the great things about the projects that we've been working on here is that it all starts at the blackboard, but it finds its way out here into the real ocean environment. We start with mathematical equations. We talk about how they might model the robots that we use and how they also model the environment that they're operating within. And it's fantastic for me and the students and everyone else involved to see how those equations actually make something work and get us data that you know we've never seen before. My name is Apoorv Sharma. I'm a rising senior at Harvey Mudd College and working in the lair with a project involving mapping shipwrecks. So I'll be using a sonar attached to um, the Iver, which is a torpedo-shaped robot you might have seen before. So I'm working on a project with an ROV, and so that means a remotely operated vehicle. It's an underwater vehicle, and so it's controlled from something that's remote. We have an overhead visual tracking system, and we're using that to position the robot. There are two different systems that we're working with, and so one was having the camera above water, but that had issues with glare and the waves, so if we did this in a pool, it wouldn't be as difficult because of waves, but actually going out into a real environment like a Catalina Island, we got to see that there were a lot of issues. Specifically, my project is using this robot right here, and then uh, you see these two, uh, we call underwater hydrophone, which is a uh, microphone that's underwater, receives the sound signals. So we use this acoustic technology to track and to follow where the shark is. I really enjoyed this project last year and I decided to stay for this year again. It really allows me to sort of apply what I've been learning in school classroom in an environment like this beautiful island right here.